Hello and welcome to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Steph and today we are going to be creating this St. Patrick's Day look and I'll be using the Earth palette from Charlie Betty Beauty. Look at this. It's got the clasps on and then when you, ooh, <laughs> when you undo them you have, look at that. I think we can all see why I got this because <laughs> we've got lots of greens in there but Charlie Betty Beauty is a UK indie brand who I've very recently discovered I love how this looks it just looks so just high quality if I didn't know this was from an indie brand I would have said this was a high-end palette definitely how beautiful is that and uh, also, the lashes I am trying are from Bunny Beauty, and Bunny Beauty is a UK indie brand, actually in the town that I currently live in. So uh, another very exciting one for me. So I do have these lashes I have on, and the Bad Bunny lashes, which uh, will be the next ones to get tried out. So yes, if you would like to see how I created this look using the Earth palette, then just keep on watching. Okay guys, so I'm trying this one a little bit differently. I'm going to be popping the picture of the palette up here um, and circling which shade I'm using. And I also have this little package here that I will open once I've done my eyeshadow um, they are lashes and it's from an indie brand which is actually in the same town I live in so really exciting and I also I have a mirror a handheld mirror finally I'm a real youtuber now look um, so yes so I'm firstly dipping into cedar which uh, you should see in the picture up there Everything I've already got on my face will be listed in the description box below if you do want to, to know what any of it is. I chose to go with the ABH eye primer today just because I trust it. It's, uh, it tends to be a good all-rounder when it comes to eyeshadow formulas. This is my first time trying Charlie Betty Beauty and so far this is uh it's a really nice green and i've got hardly any kick up in the pan not that i mind kick up just in observation so i had to really pull myself together to film today because uh there was a a mistake made with my medications that left me um without any for a couple of days and I, and I was feeling really bad about myself, um, really low, in a lot of pain. And I wasn't going to film. But then I gave myself a kick up the backside and said, hey, what's the worst that can happen? Um, there's always the chance that it will cheer you up. So here I am cheering myself up with green which is brilliant because it's St Patrick's Day also so yes I am filming this and uploading it on the same day I hope well I have to say so far I'm not getting any fallout it's building up beautifully it's not looking patchy at all Ooh. That's looking good. Hmm, what do I want to go in with? I think I'm going to be going in with Venus to uh, blend that out. Yeah, I think that's going to be perfect. Yeah, so far I am super impressed. I love finding UK indie brands just well because it, it's so much easier for me to get hold of but not just that 
also it's where I live so kind of supporting small businesses from where I come from okay and then back in with cedar just to bring that back wow look how easily they're blending and layering up and then to deepen up I'm going in with Gaia that's how you say it I'm just going to keep that tucked in just to deepen just the outer V here. These blend beautifully together. Really, really nice shadows. I absolutely love the look of this palette. I know there's a few neutrals in there, but I think mixed with kind of the red and the yellow and the green, that's going to make some really beautiful looks. Plus I'm challenging myself to, uh, to try and like neutrals a bit more. <laughs> uh, it's looking good. And then just in... With a little bit more cedar over the edge of that dark grey. And then I'm just taking a bit of Gaia and just up against my lash line there. And a little bit of cedar. And then a bit of Venus. Okay, so the bin men have just uh, been to collect the rubbish. They were really noisy, so I thought I would switch off for a second. And I've popped on my NYX Glitter Primer. And we're going in with some shimmers. So the first one I'm going in with is Ivy. And Ivy is just going to go just on this very, very outer edge here. Ooh. Oh, I love this. Oh, look at that green. Oh, wow. And then just using the other side of the same brush, I am going into Bedrock. And Bedrock is going to be going over pretty much the rest of the lid these shimmers are gorgeous wow it just blended so beautifully into that other shimmer i haven't had to work at all just they're doing work for me oh, wow okay that is beautiful okay so now i'm going into honeysuckle i have high hopes for this I'm going to be using this for an inner corner highlight. I just wanted to just lighten up the inside there. Doing that absolutely beautifully. Just taking some more of Honeysuckle. I'm just going to give it a spray. And then pop it on the inner corner here. Oh, look at that. So yeah, I'm loving how that's looking. So firstly, let me just unwrap this. I haven't even had a look at these yet. Oh, 
do love how they're wrapped. Oh, there's a little spoolie in with one of them. Okay, so these are from Bunny Beauty. Okay, so these are the two pairs of lashes that I picked up. Um, I cannot remember the name of them, so when I go off to uh, pop some on, I'll let you know then. Um, they look really, really nice. Again, vegan and cruelty free. So that's all I have on my channel. So I'm going to nip off, finish my face, and then I'll come back to show you my St. Patrick's Day look. So don't go anywhere. So I'm back with the finished look. What do you think? I uh, thought I'd add some shamrock seeing as it is St. Patrick's Day. So the cake kit liners I used are from Artitude Cosmetics. This one is Courage and this one is Harmony. And I used Harmony for the lime and then Courage to do my shamrocks. In my waterline I have the Colourpop Cream Gel Liner in Extra Frosting. The mascara is the Madeja Lash Mascara from Madage Beauty. The blush I have on is from Pout and Shout. It is the shade Rise and Shine. Beautiful yellow. The highlighter I have on my cheek and for my brow bone highlight is the Ofra Rodeo Drive. On my lips is the Melt Ultra Matte Lipstick in the shade Tomboy. And lashes. So the lashes I have on are Miami and these ones here are Bad Bunny. So uh, I have these still to try. These were really easy to apply. I think they look really nice. I like them. So yeah, I think we've come to the end. So happy St. Patrick's Day to you all. I hope I have done it justice with my makeup look. Fingers crossed. So if you've liked this video, please give it a like, thumbs up. It really helps me out. If you are new around here, then I hope you'll consider sticking around. I do a lot of colourful looks and I love to do more creative looks like this. Um, I am a huge supporter of indie brands. So if that sounds like something that you'd be interested in, then please do hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you don't miss the next time I upload. So thank you all so much for joining me today. I hope you're all having a great day, great evening, wherever you are and whatever you're doing. I hope you're taking care of yourselves. I will see you again very, very soon. Goodbye.